Hi, my name is Rebecca Mulford. I am a friend of Danielle. Um, I've known her um, almost 20 years. I am the pastor at Smithville United Methodist Church in Smithville, Missouri, which is just north of the Kansas City metropolitan area. It's like five minutes from the airport. Um, Justin had asked me to record a prayer, and I feel so honored and loved to be a part of this wonderful celebration of life for Danielle. Um, and I give God thanks for the ability of technology. Um, if it wasn't for COVID, God only knows how uh, we would reach across the miles. Will you bow your heads in prayer with me? Heavenly Father, I thank you for this day, uh, this day that is so heavy for so many. Grief is so hard. Losing a friend is so hard. Losing a daughter, a loved one, a sister. We only know just the brief amount of pain that you felt, oh God, when you sacrificed your son Jesus for us. But we also know, oh God, that it hurts because we love. Grief hurts because we love. And Danielle was that image of love for us in this world. She was so good. She is good. And honest and true. Thank you for blessing us with her wonderful life. But we are here alone without her. Well, not alone. We are here together sharing in this grief as she celebrates with you in heaven. And so I pray, oh God, that you will surround us with your presence, that you will give us moments to remember the wonderfulness of Danielle's life, that even when we are sad and when it feels like the hole in our heart will never go away, that we are reminded that you are with us and that you will never leave us or forsake us. We revel in your promise that you hear the cries of your people. We take refuge in your word where it says that when we don't have the words to pray, your Holy Spirit intercedes on behalf of us. So God, when the days are dark and long and sad, remind us of your goodness, of your faithfulness and of your love. Go before us, go with us, go behind us, stay with us always. We pray this in your son's name. Amen.